This is your step-by-step -step guide to installing the Ultralift Undermount Coverlift onto your hot tub or spa. Begin by opening the box your Coverlifter came in and check the contents against the installation guide to ensure you have all the components required. Also ensure that you have the right tools on hand. They include a 6 foot tape measure, ratchet wrench, and 5 16th socket bit, 5 16th open end wrench, cordless power screwdriver or grill, and a number of cross slot or Phillips screwdriver bits. Now you are set to start the install of your new cover lifter. Step 1. Ensure that the hot tub is at least 16 inches away from any wall, obstruction, or fence. This provides ample clearance for your cover to sit into once your cover lifter is installed. First, place your hot tub cover squarely over the hot tub and in the position you would like it to open and close. Now begin by inserting the two round plastic caps into the open ends of the round pivot arms. Then insert the two plastic square caps into the open ends of the slider pivot brackets. Then install the foam grips onto the corner support arms, first lubricating the interior of the foam grips for easier application. Then assemble the corner support arm by inserting it into the short support arm, then secure them together with three number 10 self-tapping screws on each assembly. Repeat this for the opposite side of the spa. Step 2. With your cover in the closed position, begin the next step. You need to assemble the two-piece mounting bracket using two 5 16 inch nylon lock nuts with your hot tub empty of water. Slide the large flat end of the undermount bracket assembly under the base of the spa at the edge of where the corner radius begins, approximately eight inches from the back of the spa. The upper edge of the bracket should be two inches away from the spa. Repeat the same process on the opposite side. Step 3. Then insert the slider pivot bracket into the mounting bracket as shown and position it so the back of the bracket lines up with the back edge of the spa. Then secure both slider pivot arms using the number 10 5 8 inch self-tapping screws. Then you have a choice. Secure the brackets into your deck using the supplied 1 and 1 quarter inch number 10 wood screws on both sides of the spa or you can choose to let the weight of your spa once filled with water hold the mounting brackets of the cover lifter in place. Step 4. At this point, slide the shorter end of the corner support arm, part A, into the center pole and repeat this on the opposite side. Then slide the pivot arm over the corner support arm, aligning the hole at the end of the slider pivot arm with the top hole in the slider pivot bracket. Step 5. Now position the nylon washers on either side of the pivot arm and bracket. Then secure them into place by sliding the bolt pin through, then securing that bolt pin into place using the clevis pin. Repeat this step on the opposite side of the spa. Step 6. Once this is complete, check to make sure that the center arm that crosses over the cover is one inch back of the center folding seam and that the pivot arms are one and a half inches out from the cabinet on both sides of the spa. Make sure that the center pole runs parallel to the folding seam of the cover. Then on the side of the spa, secure the pivot arm with three number 10 5 8 inch self-tapping screws to the support arm. Step back and make sure that the pivot arms are still one and a half inches out from the spa and the center pole is sitting one inch back of the center seam. Finish securing the pivot arm on the opposite side of the spa. Now place a protective layer of cardboard under the center pole, then rotate the arm so the screw holes are facing the rear of your spa, not on the top or bottom of the pole. Once in position, secure the arm using three number 10 5 8 inch self-tapping screws. Repeat this step on the opposite side of the spa. Step seven, you're almost there. Cover the self-tapping screws and wood screws with the black plastic covers that snap over the heads of each screw, finishing the look. 
Then install the J-hook into the pivot bracket in the open position hole with the hot tub cover up. This ensures added safety. And when the cover is down, move the J-hook to the closed position hole. Remember to always fold open your cover towards the lift's mounting brackets before using the cover lifter to lift the cover into its open position. This ensures a longer life for your cover and cover lifter, extending your enjoyment of your spa.